Hi guys, in this video we're going to show you another method for cutting pineapple. So we've shown you the uh, the spiral method. This method we're just going to I'd maybe call it the traditional method. It's the straightforward method. So what we're going to do is we'll get onto it and we'll show you straight away what we're going to do. Just cut the um, the top off. Just remove the top like that. Now this time we're going to cut down the sides like we did in the spiral method, but we're going to cut deeper. So the, the drawback with this method, although it's faster, is that, and simpler, is that it actually removes more flesh, because you're trying to get rid of those brown spots when you uh, remove the skin. So we, we haven't removed the bottom part yet, we're just cutting down to the bottom part, like that, and we'll remove the bottom part once we've skinned the sides. So just straight down. So we're cutting a, a thicker cut this time to try and get rid of the brown spots. So there's no brown spots left on the pineapple. They all come away with the skin. So again, you lose a bit of flesh this way, but it saves a bit of time. It's a, it's a bit easier um, if you're not familiar with the spiral method. Again, if you want to check out the spiral method, check out our videos. We've got, we've got the method there for spirals along uh, cutting the pineapple, the spiral method, along with other methods as well too. So we're just about there, just cutting it down. Okay, so that looks quite nice, doesn't it? And you just cut off the bottom there, and it moves the whole skin nicely. And there you go, there goes the pineapple, there's practically no brown spots on there. So what we're gonna show you now um, what to do with that. So just remove the skin. The skin goes away in just one whole piece, pretty much. So now we're just going to slice down. We want to take the core out. See the core, yeah, that's the hard part, and it's fibrous. You don't really want to eat that part. I juice them again. I will juice that part. So I still save it, but I, I put it through the juicer and I drink the juice from it. So we're just going to cut to the side of that core and slice right down. We're going to do the same on the other side of that core. Just going to okay, put the knife just beside that core part. We don't want to cut the core. We just want to cut beside it straight down. Okay, so that's those two pieces will be fine. We can dice them up, but we're going to look at the core part now. We just want to get rid of that core. So now we lay it flat and we just cut again beside the core. So we're actually removing that core. And again on the other side, just beside the core. And there you go, that's the hard core, fibrous core there, just completely removed. So I put that to the side and I'll put that through a juicer, I'll juice that. And I drink the juice from that one. So now it's, now you can just dice up these uh, pieces that we've got left here. Whatever method you want to use, if you want it smaller or bigger, up to you. You can halve them again, or we're just going to, we're just going to slice straight through them. And we make them reasonably sized pieces. And the same here, we're just going to slice through it. Could have that again if you want, but we're not going to do that. We're just going to go straight through. So we, we might show you some methods too to make the pieces smaller or larger, depending on what you like, and some decorative methods as well too with your pineapple. But this method here is probably the simplest, I would say, and the easiest method for dicing up the pineapple. Um, if you have a better method or a faster method, an easier method, give us a comment below and let us know. Um, also, please don't forget to. Uh, subscribe to our channel give us a thumbs up too if you like it like the video and check out our other videos and hey guys check out our website below to freeinformation.com we've got a link to the the page where we um, show you all the methods we'll give you the timing of all the different methods and what we again what we feel is the best and easiest method so again give us a thumbs up and thanks for watching this video please again like and subscribe to our other videos